Hey guys and welcome to a quick video showing you how to get rid of these pesky out of stock filters as well as I'll show you a few things as well afterwards. So to get rid of these out of stock malarkey things if you head up to the cogwheel if you change quantity from 0 to 1 and then click remember selected filter here you go. So now because you, you just want to see if one item's in stock there you go, you will see that it's just one item and it's going to get rid of those pesky pain in the booty doohickeys. Now don't forget about a few other things that you can do with this filter. So if you only want to buy stuff in Rebels, select Rebels. Pretty much sorted with that one as well. One thing that I like to get rid of is the remove from bartering. So let's say I want to find myself, let's, let's do Labs Keycard because it's a pretty good one for this. So where's the labs key card? There it is. So you can see there is a bunch, a huge amount of barter trades. Best tip I can give you, do, do not ever do barter trades. They will never be cheaper for you. If you found one, good job, but they will never be better for you. So if you tick this button and it will remove all of the barter trades. Now you can see that it is purely for rebels and that's it and they would never be out of stock where it is if you obviously have that out of stock one unticked the quantity it will show out of stock something else that might annoy some of you guys is the only show functional items so if you want to buy yourself let's say a assault rifle in this case an adar we choose adar you can see that there's loads, it's just filled up with loads of these ones that are just absolutely useless. If you come over here and click show only functional items, boom, it's now going to show you items that are ready to be used and you can get rid of those pesky, you know, pain in the ass ones. The ones that aren't actually useful and you have to build the gun from it. Uh, but finally, show only, or only show items expiring in less than an hour. There's not much point with this one. Now, I'm going to show you something about presets as well. Let's see you, you want to buy a preset. If we come up here and you have a lowest recoil build of some sort that you've got from one of my videos because you guys are awesome. Have a quick look. Let's do the M1A loud. So in this, you there is a uh, SI advanced receiver extension barrel. And let's click find parts as you can see down here it says not available what you can do is go up to this cogwheel and you see it says display offers from traders if you choose any and then click ok it's going to refresh this and it's going to show you the cheapest with like traders as well as normal people so you can actually get the cheapest possible as you can see it is a pretty good so guys, hopefully you found this guide useful. It was just a quick one because I know a lot of people are complaining about mainly the out of stock issues. But hopefully this should help you guys. If you guys got any tips and stuff, whack it down the bottom. I will be going extremely more in depth in the flea market in one of my Tarkov Academy videos. But guys, thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next video.